All right, guys, so you're about to watch a Cosmic Crucible video. Unfortunately, the audio got super scuffed. The sound that I had coming out of the web browser, for some reason, even though it was showing me the levels were normal, it was skyrocketed over my voice. But you can still kind of make me out. It is Nintendo music, so I hope you can at least vibe to it. I would normally mute everything and then talk over it. But some of these fights got so hyped from me that I feel like that would be a disservice to like the whole point of doing it live. So I'm going to let it ride. If you just want to mute it and you can just watch me do stuff like, uh, ah, ah, then you can just mute it and you can see that. You can see how the fights play out. Uh, this was a very hyped one and I enjoyed it a lot. Shout out to Kevin, retired, I guess, from Panzer Hulk. Uh, great Crucible match. And uh, I hope you enjoy it. And yeah, we're, we're still working on the setup. I did get a new boom mic, which right here. And then I got some stuff that we're trying to raise the production quality so hopefully this will be the last video where that's an issue anyway bye guys all right guys this one's gonna be a little different because i'm not live on twitch i'm working on something right now to do like roster reviews and make sure i can help people kind of build their path so this is what i'm doing on my own off stream um let's see how well i can hold up but cool we're gonna find out um kevin is i guess people have been asking me to show they want to see the size of my opponent. So Kevin's sitting at 38. Pretty even to me, but you know what? I think he's got me beat on the defense. So he didn't full clear me, so if I could full clear him, I'd win. Something I did, and I don't want to just the people yet, is I took Tangled Web. I think I can use Tangled Web somewhere, probably against room 6. But yeah. If I can get the full clearing. So what I want to do is I want to start with these couple teams first and see if we can squeeze that out. So I'm going to use Infinity Watch here against the Tangled Web Doom Yo-Yo. Yo-Yo here is essentially useless because Spider Weaver is a protector. So let's see how this goes. We do need to land the ability block out of the block of Doom. Luckily that's not a wood one, so Weaver can't actually stop that.
again, we have to hit Tangled Web, unfortunately. We heal, so again, we're giving her more energy. Tangled, uh, uh, Spider Weaver's kids. She has like a phantom charge again, right? Nope, she doesn't. So now I kind of wish that I did have the when I can fall in on it. Now without having more level. She's gonna use her special here, right? Let's see if we can do it again. We got close. So they just give her one. some hope. Okay, we need to kill Spider Weaver. There we go. Okay. Whew, that's a sigh of relief. We did just activate Yo-Yo, though. Let's try and get her gone. We have some immunity as well. Unavoidable. We want to give her a chance to dodge. There we go. There's that four. We're looking for. Just no good answer. I know Tangled Web Mirror matchup works really well, guys. Before you slam me in the comment section about that, it's just not something I'm interested in doing. I mean, that I gotta take on that one. Not great. Because I think I only had one loss to give in the event I don't go over here. Not great. I really think in Infinity Watch is gonna knock them out of the park and give you a few But, uh, Spider Weaver Charge is what it's all over the place. It never seems to work the same way twice. So now, this one does not have Phantom X, so we are going to do our Eternals. I'm going to that. And I think I'm not going to use them. I'm tempted to use them, but I'm going to hold off. Let's go ahead and use Eternals. We're going to grab our dad for it, like we did last time. We're going to grab Now, where I think I went wrong, wrong last time was I went for Gambit. I'm not going to go for Gambit. Instead... We'll use a special. This is bad because I really, really, really. Well, I think my damage didn't get on that. Oh, that was good damage. Now Icarus goes. If Icarus can get the kill, come on, Red Guardian. But super close. Looks like we're gonna get Dazzler here. Okay, I'm confident I can get the first damage. Uh, do as much damage as we can. I think she's just gonna drain the grid.
first. I think we still gotta go for Sunfire first. Just in the event that we don't get through it, I still wanna have some good somebody here. Lots of buffs, so he's probably dead. If not, he was super close to it. I want to get energy to Doom, please. Doom did get energy, that's good. Kestrel's gonna get these attacks. Oh. Kestrel is gonna die. Kestrel's gonna die. Why is Kestrel gonna die here? This sucks. This super duper sucks. There's all three of my attacks gone. No. Oh, she lived. Just long enough to kill Rogue, maybe? Yes! Yes, okay, but Gambit is, is still an issue. He's still an issue. Come on, Kestrel. Keep healing off that heal block. Heal block didn't land that time. Oh, no. Oh, Kestrel's still alive. But Gambit is full life. No! What the heck? Oh, this is another L. This is another fat L. Let's get the speed. Maybe Doom can clinch this out. Like, he's not going to get another stealth, right? But he's getting so much speed. Come on. Come on, Shang-Chi, please. That's some good damage. Oh, God. Oh, God. Come on. 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 Okay. Darkhold is still an issue, though. Darkhold is still a very, very real issue for a pit. My level of excitement right now with this Zelda music playing does not add up at all. I also just realized the Zelda music was super loud. Let me turn that way down. I'll check the volume after. I might have to record over that. Sorry guys if that was if that was super loud and you missed out on all the, the hype for those fights. Okay, um I lost my doom. I really wanted to use Doom and I lost Dorm. I really was relying on both of those people for this Darkhold team. And we lost Infinity Watch. So, I gotta go all out on this. 
Omega Red's really got to carry me here. Uh, I got to do a burner attack first. First and foremost. I'm leaning towards... Oh, no, I got I got Tangled Web Undying still. So we can Tangled Web Undying with Omega Red, maybe? Maybe that gives me enough. Because I, I need the trauma. Tangled Web gives me trauma. Omega Red also does trauma. So what do I need to do? I want to send in a team that can survive long enough to pull the Morgan. I don't know if that's possible. Because Morgan is going to hit so hard and she flips, right? She's going to hit so hard and she does huge flips. Um, yeah. The flips are worrisome. Very, very worrisome. I also have Wakanda. I need to at least save some things for these next matches to get through them. Uh, what on earth can I use? I feel like Web Warriors would just get completely demolished before Morgan does her special. The reason I can't go straight Tangled Web, Omega Red... Undying is because Hella and Omega Red are both controllers. They're going to get screwed. But I can go Emma. If I go Emma Weaver, I think my Weaver still goes first. Also, I need to, I need to switch out my uh, 2099 needs to be a skirmisher here. For sure, 100%. If I had Dad Bros, I'd maybe consider keeping him a raider but i used ad rose with that uh maternal team so let's swap that out okay i still can't believe that unlimited team worked my lord okay uh no defense up i want to avoid having defense up because morgan's gonna flip it on at least two probably three people Dark Hunters, maybe? Maybe, like, somebody with some speed mechanics? If I go Dark Hunters, the upside is Morgan's going to get so much speed, she's going to go pretty quickly on her second turn. That's kind of where my head's at. And they're really big. The defense up here is liability with the flips, is what I'm saying. Because Agatha is just going to kill everything. Oh god, Agatha is just going to kill everything. Something with death proofs, maybe. Uh, if I had... If I had Magneto... No, because no trauma. This one's impossibly tough. Maybe Hero as Guardians. Now, the reason Hero as Guardians would be an, it, like a maybe is because they get their buffs, hopefully, from Valkyrie, maybe. Big maybe. Also, again, a bunch of Mystics. The question is, what does that leave me for the other rooms? I think I can muddle my way through the other rooms, especially because I have Wakanda and stuff like that. Bionic Avengers. We'd be able to flip the bad stuff with Viv, if she lived long enough for that. She's a protector, not a controller, which is nice. Black Rider would just get demolished. I'm going in with Hero as Guardians. I'm deeply concerned, and I should have hit Valkyrie in a corner, but if we get a Valkyrie passive, I think we can survive. Oh my god, that damage. Valkyrie's dead. Please, please, passive. No passive. Wolverine's gonna kill everybody. Not great. Not great. No. Did we at least pull the Wong ultimate? We didn't even pull the Wong ultimate. Oh my god, and it, it just went so fast. It just went too fast. Oh my god. Um. I have no choice but to go for it now, though. I literally have no choice. Oh man. If I use Emma, there's a world where Weaver goes first, but
but the special is unavoidable anyway. Crap, I should have opened with it? Oh, poopy. Poopy, poopy, poopy pants. Poopy, poopy, poopy pants. Um. Okay. In that case, we're going to do Weapon X, and I'm going to throw Emma with them. So let's grab Weapon X. Where are they? We don't have Wolverine anyway. We're going to throw Emma here. And the reason for this is quite simply to get Omega Red to go first. And, and maybe try and kill Wolverine. I guess. Who can I possibly try and kill here? We need to rewind her. Have to. We gotta land this and resist it. Okay, so we just lose. GG! I don't want to say well played because it wasn't. I just lose. We gotta let her ride and see if Tangled Web can pull off some sort of magic trick, I guess. I, there's Really, there's no hope here. can't flip anything so the move here is probably to kill Wolverine Wolverine's gonna die at the opening of the next place anyway so that's whatever so let's do as much damage as we possibly can to Agatha right we gotta do it that was a lot of damage to her enough to push her into stealth that rewind on him really, really, really aggravates me. I don't like that one bit. Some slows out there. I don't know why I would even care about doing that. Stun him. So he, he could open up with special next time. That wasn't very smart either. And now she's going to open up. She's going to open up with her ultimate again. Morgan, I screwed myself so hard. I screwed myself in so many ways on this fight. Yikes. And I auto lose because of how many... Yeah, because of how many fights I had to take to try and beat the other two. This is auto lose territory now. Well, uh, if we got to eat the ultimate anyway, let's do our best. I don't know. I'm gonna grab Zombie Iron Man and I'm gonna grab Noir as well. We're stacking the Mystics. I don't like it, but we're stacking the Mystics. I might go make Noir a Skirmisher as well. I will go make Noir a Skirmisher as well. There's also Mr. Negative. His minions do reduce Mystic Turn meter. He summons one on spawn, so that's good. But Noir does damage. We're gonna need the damage, I think. Just to even have a chance with uh, with the Morgan. No, we're just gonna do this. Let's go. But yeah, I do want to make her him a skirmisher. Let's save this team. Him as a raider is cool if you have him with Dad Rose. That's about it. I don't think this wins. I'm hoping to be pleasantly, pleasantly surprised. Cool little World of Warcraft ad. Man, this is... My first attack really blew it. Morgan just did way too much damage. Lesson learned. You gotta go in big. You gotta go in hard. We still have one source of trauma. I really wish I had Omega Red instead of Noir for this. Because Omega Red actually did some good damage and some survivability there for a little bit i want to get a bleed and no, i'm not going to land any bleeds on wolverine okay well we got some bleeds we got defense down offense down did anything land on morgan nothing landed on morgan she kills wolverine almost kills 2099 that person succeeds in killing 2099 we are in so much trouble it's it's ridiculous I, like, need this stun to land. And it was resisted. Oh, the trauma was resisted. So that's the same thing as it being resisted. Oh, loss. Big L. 
who is Wong about to annihilate with his special because I was silly? Does it still do ability block outside? It does. Two turn ability block. He's then gonna basic. Does it do trauma outside war? I don't think so. No. I need to stop the Wong special. Is Morgan about to use her special? I really hope not. Does she have a vulnerable? She does. Like, I need to kill the Agatha because... He can evade. Who cares if he can evade? I need to stop her stealth so I can then hard target Morgan. Lots of Greg focus there. That's good. This has extra focus, so some of the stuff lands. Defense down is good. At the end of the day, we're not able to hurt this Morgan until we can stun her and trauma her. We look. Agatha's gone. That's huge. Let's go for Wong next. Man, she's so low, but she's going to... Uh, offense, defense down, plus we have the offense up. Oh my god, did Tangle Web do it? Oh, hope is alive! Hope is alive! Let's go! What a rough team. I misplayed so hard, but hope is alive. And here's another stun to end it off. Great. Hopefully this Doctor Strange isn't about to alter something. <laughs> that would have been awkward. Basic. Well, Weaver hits hard. Yo, Weaver might be a seven star, seven red star character in my mind. I might do that if I can ever get her seventh yellow. Wow. I don't deserve the win. I don't deserve the win at all. At all. Oh, well, I still got to clear these three teams. Let's watch me watch me whiff it on these three teams now. Okay. Um, let's start here. I can use Wakanda as a cheat code. Okay, let's use A-Force here. Where is it? Oh, I don't have them saved as a Crucible team. Whoopsies. Uh, we don't need Namor. It's kind of useless. Let's throw Black Bolt. Because Black Bolt's going to get defense up, and he's going to take an extra charge off that minion's life. That'll be helpful. Oh, because Green Goblin landed his defense down, my Jessica Jones goes first. That's fantastic. Nigo's going to flip that stuff. I do believe she goes first in this situation. Yeah, that's good. We can get the ability block. Counterattack stops it in its tracks. Not a fan of that. Uh, he's going to die to the splash damage. Let's go ahead and take out Killmonger. He did not die to the splash damage, but he does have ability block. So, good enough. Permanently dead because of Black Bolt. Oh, I meant to target the guy up top to make sure I hit the other minion. That's okay, I suppose. I'm going to do basic. Get as many death proofs off as possible. Okay, we got that off. Great. Get this Nobu down. Perfect. Get Kingpin down. Not clean. Not great. But we don't need to be good. We just need to clear. So... Uh, oh, Nobu Rez coming in. We don't need to be good. We just need to clear now. So that's fortunate. So we still have Wakanda. Uh, so I'm not going to use Wakanda on the opening attack. Instead, because Wakanda can lose this. Why don't we do something like this? Just for the opening attack, just to pull some cooldowns and stuff. Why don't we get rid of you? He does defense down, though. I didn't use Star-Lord, did I? Let's 
Squirrel grows fast. America Chavez is fast. So maybe. Maybe Surfer doesn't make the cut. Maybe you make the cut instead. And then Star Lord. Get to try something a little different. Where's Star Lord? I'm bigger than that. Did I use Star Lord? Fury's gonna get us going faster. Zemo's gonna strip stuff, put ability block. Cloak and dagger gonna kill people. That's the idea. If dagger gets a blind, just GG over. So there's that. Do as much damage to Squirrel Girl as we can. Speed up to everybody. Let's, uh, suppose a blind can't hurt. It's not really going to help either. We did not get a defense down on Squirrel Girl, which means I'm not going to try and kill Squirrel Girl. I'm going to try and kill Kate, which I succeeded. That's good. But everybody got too low, so Squirrel Girl's about to pop off. Luckily, nope, none of them have heal block. How, do, how did none of them get heal block? That's next level. Maybe it's just not in there. Maybe it's not a possibility for them to get heal block. It is what it is. We got one down, which means the follow-up follow kill is super easy. And that's good enough for me. Because again, I just need to get the... I just need to win. I got enough. Wow, another heal. Didn't she just heal? What is this? Smart money now is to just deposit. Now that she used her heal, pause it, wait it out. I kind of just want to see if they'll kill me fast enough. Okay, Squirrel Girl probably going to have her heal back up. It is what it is. It's fine. We'll Wakanda it now. Oh, I should have done that for the Asgardian team. What was I thinking? What am I going to use against the Asgardian team? I got to have stuff. We got Surfer. I got Bionic Avengers, I have Black Order, Dark Hunters. We'll get through it. So yeah, let's Wakanda this. Just because it's it's simple, it's easy, it's done. And I'm going to take out nobody. I like the damage from M'Baku. If Killmonger's ultimate was not a rebound, then I would take him out for this. But it is a rebound, so... I sweat it. Let's put everything we possibly can on Scroll Girl. She was at least one turn away from heal. That's important. Because now, hopefully, wow, the Miss Marvel ultimate might screw it for us. Okay, 10% battery life. I hear you. If I basic, Koye gets an assist. And then Black Panther. Because I don't want to push anybody. I don't want Squirrel Girl to go first because she is going to heal next time. Wait, why didn't a Oh, it was Echo. Of course there's no assist. What am, I, what am I thinking? Oh man, we got it. We're at the mercy of. We're at the mercy of. Oh, I should have basic. Stupid. Oh, but we got it. We got it. Okay, we got it. Striker Black Panther. Okay, Striker Black Panther. I mean, we're at the mer I, th I still think we would have won without Kate. They're not flipping anything or doing anything all that impressive. Man, I had such a brain fart. Why am I not getting assists? Okay, now the Asgardian Phoenix team. We're just going to ignore Phoenix, let Phoenix die, and then we win, right? Or maybe we'll answer the, the age-old question. What happens if Phoenix is the last character standing, Dark Phoenix that is, at the end of a match? Do you lose? Stay tuned to find out in a couple seconds.
Let's go in there with Bionic Avengers to start it off. Basically, punch across. Watch. It might, it'd be really funny if I lose. It's like, well, you can't go back in. Uh, so you lose. I, I guess it'd be funny. I don't know. Uh, we're not going to find out, though, because Phoenix died way too quick. We got Skirmish, our striker, on Viv, so let's go for the Valkyrie. And now, no matter what, the matchup is infinitely easier. Let's take out Jane. All right, we did it. We did it. We won. We won a Crucible, guys. And we just got to win next one, too. And then two and three. We maintain our two and three win rate forever. We never get to win, but we never have to lose. So just uh, if you guys want to see what he did to mine, he infinity watched my uncanny. Uh, for my dark hold, he started with Secret Avengers. He took out Drax, and it looks like he actually paused, and he waited probably as soon as Morgan did her ultimate, or special. He just paused and waited. Uh, then he did Weapon X Dormammu for the rest of it. For my, just a mutant team, because obviously I had Tangled on offense. He did Magneto, or sorry, my Magneto Psylocke Axeman team. He did Wakanda. Not surprised that was an easy win for him. And this is where he couldn't get the clear, so I have uh, Uncan or sorry, Unlimited, but I do have Phantom X to stop uh, Eternals from being able to do much. Like, if there was a Phantom X on my enemy team, my Cersei wouldn't have hit, so no turn me to rewind, and then all hell breaks loose. So you have to bring Emma. So low key doesn't work. And even then, Icarus, I think Icarus still hits, but he doesn't pull the dodges. So then Cersei goes, and then Rogue goes, and then you're screwed as well. So I don't think the Dad Bros get to do as much as you want them to do. Maybe if you make uh, Icarus a Raider, that could work out. But that's the idea there. I like Kingpin for that, and I like Phantom X over Sunfire. He followed it up uh, with Eternals, Emma, Loki, and Zemo. I think that's a little bit too much speed control. You want some power in there. And then he tried to use Infinity Wash and couldn't get the clear. He used... Um, very similar to what I tried to use, actually, on the Young Avengers. But his was a punch down, and he probably played it a lot better than mine. Uh, maybe Zemo was a waste there. Probably killed Squirrel Girl with the Dagger Ultimate. Maybe he got the defense down on Squirrel Girl that I just didn't get. That's possible. And then he gambled my Gamma. And then what did I do? <laughs> I was a mess. We Bionic Avenger, the Asgardian Phoenix team. We... A4's Black Bolt, random ass team. The Underworld, uh, this was stressful. So we tried to just straight Infinity Wash the Tangled Web and Doom uh, Yo-Yo team. Didn't work, so we had to throw in Dormammu and then we got it done, though that was pretty sketchy as well. We got a lucky Weaver kill, if I recall correctly. And this is where we get the win, right? So my Eternals team didn't have to go through dodges, so we actually got to take out Red Guardian and got to take out Dazzler. And then we had a huge fail. This was really bad because I needed, to, I did take out Sunfire here, but I didn't feel comfortable leaving it with Rogue and Gambit being that Rogue was about to use her special again. I think that would have been a death sentence. So I go back in with Doom and hopefully the audio is not too scuffed on that, but that was pretty hyped fight. Uh, very, very lucky. This one was just like a safety first hit so that, you know, it was foolproof with, uh, with the Wakana team. And this one, again, we played it super poorly. So I did as Guardians to pull abilities, but I did not get the Morgan special. So I kind of improvised at Weapon X Emma to try and do some damage in there. Didn't accomplish much. And then Tangled Web got in there and did work. And I'm going to have to review the footage. But I think... Did Weaver get to go before Morgan did? She gets... 20% from 2099. She's one faster. She might still get to go first. Oh no, because we gave her three mystics. So she gets 20%, then she also got uh, 15. I'm not sure. Anyway, I think Morgan must have went first. I'm going to have to review the footage. But I do think that's a, a good matchup. That was in six as well, right? So that's a scary Dark Old team. Anyway, guys, that's it for the video. I uh, hope you had fun. I hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.